<laughs> gallon jug of water frozen. Well, it wasn't a second ago. Yeah, now it's saying I don't have any. Ah, uh, more of this kind of nonsense. <laughs> Apparently I have an infinite gallon of water. <laughs> it's acting infinite right now. Because it's letting me continue to craft as many as I want. I'm not in range of that uh, water pump. Well, the problem is I can't, with the way it is now, I can't, uh, I can't put 15 units in the gallon jug, then boil it and put it right back in the jug again, which is what I wanted. I, I want a jug full of clean water, but I can't accomplish it. Hmm. That's going to be a little bit irksome. So, 1747 already. Time flies. Let's Yeah, I think we're just going to have to... I don't know what I'm going to do. <clears throat> yeah, containers... We're, they're, they're still working on some stuff, but... Um, it's going to be a little, a little rough if I can't... Uh, carry liquids with me, given that I can't use vehicles either. Well, we'll just fill up what we can with water before we take off. I don't worry too much about it. All right, so we got Fab to two, third of the way to three, tailoring still at one. Uh, we don't have enough raw materials here to do the kind of leveling up that I want to do. Um, yeah, the water source is pretty much the only real attraction to staying here for any length of time. Not worried about meat from the cows or anything like that. I think we'll just do a little bit more crafting, sleep the night away, and then uh, head up to that rural house in the morning. Kind of go from there. I can't think of too many more tools that I need right now. Anything I make, I gotta carry. <clears throat> I guess I could do a makeshift pot instead of the brazier. 13 pounds. A makeshift pot is 13 pounds. <laughs> that's that's quite makeshift, all right. I wonder if the, uh, the brazier is less than that. One liter and 13 pounds for that thing. Uh, oh, yeah, I should do some bandages and the crowbar. And then I guess take advantage of my infinite water to boil all the bandages. Go ahead and get a crowbar first. Bandages. Sure. Do actually do 15 at a time. No. Oh, I don't have the water. I don't have the fire going. Man. <laughs> oh yeah. There, there's the 15. So yeah, it's it's. Well, it says 15 of 23. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know where it's getting the 23. Fine, just do it. And now I'm missing water. <laughs> I love it when I come up missing water. Uh, partial craft with some water.
<laughs> oh, here we go. All right, we got them. Oiled makeshift bandages, 15. Little, little clunky, but we can do it. All right, are we still stuck with having to reselect this over? Ah, oh, we are. Crap. Man, I wish they hadn't changed this. First aid of 31% already. Hmm. How many rags do I have? Almost 200 laying around? Fine. More makeshift bandages. Oh, that time the gallon jug emptied out. So I think if I stand right in the middle here, I can probably do it. One, two, three. Yeah, I should be able to do it. I should be able to use the water from the well, or from the pump, and craft directly into the gallon jug. Let's try it to make sure. Fifteen, please. <laughs> nope, still not doing it. Hmm. And we got back that goofy gallon jug of water frozen. Alright, whatever. So we're up to 43 boiled makeshift bandages. <laughs> Medieval swordsmanship cannot be used unarmed. Thank you. We're going to just keep slapping bandages on while we're damaged. Oh, man. This is... Just to level up to one. Uh, first aid, 91%. All right, so first aid one. <clears throat> That's all I care about for now. We'll heal to full regardless, so we'll just keep the rest of them. Uh, so we got a good supply of bandages. What else am I going to take with me in the morning? Not the gun. I do need to take the sword. Crowbar. I won't need a rubber hose. Clean water, dirty one, hot. Clean, clean water, dirty ten, or hot ten. Sure, I guess we'll... <laughs> Whatever. Fine, leave it there. I don't really care. And I'm not going to take anything except for the string. Mm, maybe some cordage. Um... Oh, see, here we go. Now it's telling me that again. I do it this way. Nope. Yeah, I'm still not going to do it. All right, we're going to end up leaving most of this canned stuff then. We'll go ahead and eat as much of the canned things as I can, bulk up. So what do we got? A little bit of food, a little bit of water, that'll be fine. Bandages, <clears throat> the basic tools, and my two swords. Yeah, it looks good. Alright, anything else I'm desperate to get done? Don't think I need anything else on this list. Can't do much here till we level up our, our tailoring a bit.
And the rest of it's not really going to be something I need to worry about for now. Nineteen twenty-eight. What can we craft for a while? Or do I get moving now? Nineteen twenty-eight. Seven twenty-eight. We'll get there pretty quick. Let's just get moving. I don't see a reason to stick around. Yeah, I'm not too worried about the rest of this. I think I might make... Since we got the wire here, and that's a little harder to come across, I might take a minute to make a few more let's see the, uh, one of those make a few more of the lock picks before we take off and it's going to get dark here pretty quick alright that gives us 10 that'll do let's go ahead and get moving Goodbye, farm. Treated us pretty well. Safe mode. Safe mode on. Nice fat body sight would be pretty cool right about now. More cordage. Right, we'll hop up onto the silos first, get a look around. <laughs> the hub. Ah, uh, another farm and the hub. Hmm gonna be another one with the barn maybe another NPC and then it's either out past the hub or north yeah I need to break things about a TV, huh? We'll take some biscuits. <laughs> That's a lot of cookbooks. Nothing else. Alright, the big score is bubble wrap, apparently. Well... Hmm. I'm not sure I want to go to that other farm. It's got a chance for some good tools. But we're going to have to play around with more zombies. We might not have a uh, friendly NPC there this time. Yeah. Alright, let's we'll risk it. Might be able to get into the house on the first little thing without the uh, zombies getting out of the barn. Oh, tough zombie. Hmm. I think we can skirt around him without getting his attention. As long as he stays right on the outside edge of the range. Oh, body sights! Uh, why did you move around? Inhaler, windbreaker, no, nope, don't care. Flashlight. 
Uh, again, I don't really care. More zombies showing up, though. Yeah, they're already out of the barn. Grabbers and fat zombies, tough zombie. Um, Any group of zombies is incredibly dangerous to me. Oh, crap. Giant wasps. Oh, no. Nope, we're out of here. <laughs> the farmhouse is infested with wasps. We are noping right out of there. That's a big nope. Okay. So, decision time. Let's do some audience participation. North or east? Which direction? North or east? North along the road or east past the hub? No, I'm not stopping up the hub. <laughs> it seems like a pretty even split so far. There's a few more leaning towards the north. South, huh? Eh, well. <clears throat> I know Korg wants me to go take on the, uh, the Demon Spider Queen lair. Do I get an accomplishment for doing that in the first day? Is the hub linked to anything? Yes, if you're interested in doing NPC quest stuff. It's pretty cool. I just have no interest in doing NPC quest stuff. Uh, hey, we have a, a green F. <laughs> that is a cabin. Am I going to get a fireball wand? Fireball wand, please. Not gonna let me in, huh? I don't want to break a window. If I'm gonna break a window, I'm gonna break. Oh, yeah, I don't have to break that. I'm gonna break the bathroom window because that at least has doors I can close easily. All right, what's what's under the TV this time? It's a scroll of Hori Blast. So, what do you what do you think, Korg? Can uh, can illiterates read spell scrolls? Apparently I can read the title. <laughs> Let's take it. Let's find out. Oh, mana crystals. Crystals, but no wand. I didn't get a wand. No. Uh oh, the irradiated lemon. Last chance, and nothing there either. Well, we got ammo for a wand, but we didn't get a wand itself. So it says read. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Might want to fix that. <laughs> the answer is apparently yes. <laughs> uh. Yes, it's magical script. <laughs> Picture magic? Yeah, I guess it could be it could be pictograms of uh magic. <laughs> Technically, since that's the way the game's built, I wouldn't feel too bad about abusing it. But the person most likely to fix it is actually here and uh, so let's not so the sun's about to go down. I'm going to wait here. We're not going to travel at night on foot. So let's go ahead and hang out here for the evening. We've actually got a lot more resources here if there was anything else I wanted to do. So we'll close up all the windows. Okay. More wire. <laughs> I could make more lockpicks. Not much in the way of metal in this particular place. So, a lot of uh, a lot of rags. I could take down. Uh, I could take down a few more windows for the sheets for for rags for our tailoring skills. 
I don't want to spend a whole crap load of time just sitting in one place, though. And we do have... I'd have to knock this door down, but I believe there is a uh, water heater furnace combo over there. <laughs> Did we get roofs on this one yet? I can't remember if they put a roof on it. <laughs> you slip while climbing and fall down again. Yeah, apparently we have a roof now. Cool. Alright, problem's gonna be light. I'd have to get wood, toss it in the oven for light. I can't read. I could do some crafting. At this point, tailoring is what I want. I want to get to four tailoring. I need to get the needle put together. Bunch of uh, thread. Which wouldn't, like I said, be a problem. Hmm. better. Why, you ask? Well, because a fireplace has a flue up through which goes the smoke. So if I use that instead of that, then I don't have the occasional smoke inhalation to worry about. Alright, so lots of couch we could do. For more rags. Does this one have a no 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 blanket no pillow. of wood. That'll get us light. The, the hall command? Yep. The backslash key. Hall items on the ground. My quick, quick tip series has it. I got most stuff in my quick tip series. <clears throat> Anytime you got a question like that, just Go hit up my quick tip series and browse through the, the names of the episodes. I try to name them something. The whole point of that series is to be easily searchable so people can find the information they're looking for. So, that'll usually answer the question pretty quick. Alright, so yeah, we are going to have a problem because the thread is not reloading properly. Um, I might debug my way around that. We'll see. For now, we just need rags and, and stuff for uh, raw crafting. I'm not really using thread in the tools to uh, to modify anything, so we shouldn't run into it too much. Um, anything else I want to do? I think we've got enough here, probably. 154 rags. We'll go grab this. All right, yeah, two hundred seven's fine. Um, 
other thing is going to be spring. Let's go take down... I don't think I'll need this wood over here, so... Tear down these curtains. Plug that up so we block line of sight. Uh, get the fire going and disassemble some more sheets. Let's do <laughs> make string and rope and then we can take it apart again. That'll probably work. Oh, that's right. I need a needle. Hey, needle. Now let's take a look. That's a little better. Leg warmers still on the old? Yep, leg warmers are still on the old. Too low a skill level. Um, sure. Tailoring two. Next up, we were doing what? Balaclava? So, two more plus a little bit extra. Oh, unless we fail. Did we make it? Nope. One more. Uh, actually, we'll keep one balaclava. Cut up everything else. English fire. So, it's 1 a.m. We are tired. Good time to sleep. We're going to travel in the daytime. Let's <clears throat> four is what I want to get to. Could just go for the travel backpack, I guess. <clears throat> I don't have the leather for the hiking backpack anyway. Yeah, let's do a travel backpack, then we'll go take a nap. Oh, yeah. Uh, my torso is very encumbered, I know. And we're also hungry. We have a nice sandwich. Put out our fire and go 99.
All right, Korg. You should be able to post links now. <clears throat> uh, things always being frozen in containers or advanced inventory? Advanced inventory. <laughs> By far. At least for my personal opinion, definitely the advanced inventory. Your links didn't go through. You weren't, uh, you weren't vipped. <laughs> so nobody could see your links. The, uh, the bot said no links for you, but, uh, I vipped you. You've been vipped. So you should be able to do your links now. Oh, Toastum's being junk food. Sacrilege! Sacrilege! Let's hide this scroll under some Toastums. Uh, where is the box of Toastums? There we go. There we go. Now I don't have to look at that silly scroll anymore. Alright, so noontime. Very hungry. Got no food to eat here, really. Just what I brought with me. So we'll have a... Some pickled herring. And one clean water. What exactly is Toastums? Pop tarts for those in the US. <laughs> Toastums are Pop Tarts. Toaster pastries. That's Toastums. Youch. Two plus weeks to fix, huh? <laughs> and it's going to consume your attention. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what other bugs are, are being encountered. Uh, what is it? The, the liquids thing. I don't really get affected by the frozen thing much, but the liquids thing is a little bit eh. All right, so what am I going to do? Um, no reason to stick around. Oh, well, I could do like a duster. We got a jean jacket currently. I think I prefer the trench coat. Do we have... I don't have pants yet, do I? Oh, we're running around in a loincloth. <laughs> so, yeah, I think we should do the duster before we take off. Torso, arms, and legs. And we'll get rid of the jean jacket. Fail, 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 fail. Lots of fail. Double extra fail. <laughs> Do we make it to the next level? Look at that! 94%. <laughs> Love all the failing. Lots of extra XP. Alright, so uh, now we can get rid of the last of the primitive stuff. Oh, wait, I need gloves too. Glove liners. And light gloves. And let's... Oh, really? I can do a short rope? Sure. Easier to carry that. Tailoring four. Ooh, takes a little longer than I expected, though. We might have to stick it out one more night. <laughs> it's already 3.30 in the afternoon. So, we made it to tailoring four. That was that was fairly quick. Um, now the problem is just uh, materials, raw materials. Don't have any fancy chitin nearby. Don't have the leather for the hiking backpack. And we're getting hungry again. Can't spend too much time here. Give me these strings. 
That's it. I think that's it. Don't want it. Don't want it. Yeah, don't want any of it. Uh, I didn't bring my second brazier. I should have brought my second brazier as well. Let's disassemble the stove. Get that second brazier made. And sure, we'll take a couple of chunks of steel. All right, so we got boots. Whoa, wait. I don't have anything on my legs? Am I not wearing my duster? I'm not wearing my duster. Oh, crap. Jean Jacket's got 18 items. All right, this is the part that worries me here. So I want to unload that. So it's all in my inventory now. The Jean Jacket is empty. Cool. All right, goodbye, Jean Jacket. So we just got the one. <laughs> duster with 21. That's funny. All the items are in the duster instead of the travel pack. Whatever, though. So we got the travel pack. We got plenty of carry space. I'll slip on the uh, leather. Yeah, I'll slip on the leather uh, backpack at certain points. Uh, I think we're good, though. So a little, a little late. I'm a little worried about how late it is. Any other magic cabins? No other magic cabins. Uh, I know about... What's the insert menu? How do I get to the insert menu? <laughs> do I have to go to it from, like, travel pack and then insert? Insert. Insert items into travel pack. So if I pick like this, or is it going to put the actual pouch in or is it going to take the items from the pouch? It'll put the pouch in. Yeah. I'm okay with the auto at the moment. So I'm vastly under my weight capacity. Well, not vastly, actually. But I'm under my weight capacity and all that. I'm not too worried about. So everything on the left is the things that are not currently in. Wait, where'd the pouch go? Oh, never mind. I, I did it this way last time. All right. Not terribly concerned about that at the moment. We'll 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 figure it out. Yeah, let's get moving. Three thirty. We can we can make some distance. Groundhog. Actually, before we do, let's go break that door down and tank up on some clean water. Theoretically. Whoops. Ah, we filled it. <laughs> Apparently it had none. Yeah, apparently it had none. Alright. 
I didn't actually check before I started interacting. Safe mode on. Hit the road. Ah, Albear. <laughs> oh crap. Oh crap. <laughs> he already spotted me. Oh man. Hmm. <laughs> uh. Out in the middle of the area. I gotta head back to the house. I got no choice. He's gonna he's gonna catch me probably before I get there. Oh nope, he's not after me yet. Oh see, now he doesn't have my attention. Alright, we'll give him we'll give him a wide berth here. <laughs> oh now it's wild boar, also hostile. Man, we're just going to die out in the middle of nowhere to animals. Oh, I know they'll chase, but only if they get in detection range. Oh, I saw demon spiderlings again. <laughs> crap. Crappity crap. And a clay golem. 40 to the west. And there's the spiders also playing with the clay golem. Alright, you guys have fun. So now we just need a troll to show up. That's, uh, I, that'll, that'll finish off our random magiclism stuff, right? Having a troll show up. Wolf, wolf pack. Far enough away to ignore. I'm worried about moving fast. Normally I would just be cruising along, but... I think I, do I still have my safe mode set down to like 30? I can't remember. Yeah, safe mode proximity distance. All right, let's bump this back up. Let's bump it back up to 50. My evasion chances are way less on these settings, so normally I have it down to cut down on the things bothering me with the constant interruptions. Oh, crap. Is north just going to be this stupid farm? Yep. <laughs> Lovely. Who chose this? All right, all you guys that pick north, you're on my naughty list now. It's not even the one with a house. It's just the rent, the one with the silos, and that's it. Nothing else here. Is that a crop picker? Automatic tractor. Hmm. Oh, zombie. Zombie? Hmm. I don't think I'm going to get shown much considering the position of the river and so on. Cabin and nothing else. Hmm. Not going to backtrack over that way. Uh, eh. Hmm. Multiple zombies in the area. Well, I think I'm going to go due east instead of going back down the road. For a ways, see how it looks. If it cuts off with more forest, then we... I'm, I'm not sure if I'll cut through the forest and then head back down that way. We'll see. And another clay golem. Right in my path. Uh... 
<laughs> Big golems and wolves. Let's try to split the difference. And Grim Howlers. Alright, I guess we are going back to the road. Didn't wanna. The road's kind of scary with what was down there earlier. What I don't want is another... Death by uh, spiders. <laughs> that would suck. down around the boars before I run back into the owlbear. Alright, safe mode back on again. Oh crap. Oh crappity crap. Not good. Are they faster than me? I think they're gonna be faster than me. Get around the corner. Gotta stop running, otherwise I won't be able to fight <laughs> if they do show up. Alright, looks like we we broke vision range quickly enough. Radio tower! That's more like it. Alright, what do you think this time? What, should we get another telescope? And a SWAT truck! <laughs> oh man, I must have been good this week. I must have done some good deeds! Back to the age-old question of do we let the churl <laughs> actually use guns? What do you think? The uh, full loot soldier? Is that what we're looking for? The full loot soldier? I'd settle for the uh, the telescope. Full loot soldier would be a little bit much. Oh, we got the sleeping spot. Oh, well. That's definitely not the one I was hoping for. Sleeping bag on top of a makeshift bed. <laughs> So, not what I was hoping for. Trolls cannot drive. We have the Wayfarer trait. No driving. Yeah, yeah. Alright, what do we get? M4A1, Remington Wingmaster. Extra ammo. <laughs> That's uh, 78 rounds for the M4. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. That's even a work. Oh, no, no battery charge. Look at that. Perfect engine, gas in the tanks, broken security systems, got wheels, just no battery charge, which would be the easiest thing to fix. Otherwise, a pretty damn good looking SWAT truck. 
Oh, that's right. We got to the top of the tower anyway. Mansion! Dairy farm. Hmm. What is a blue H? What is, what is this one? Oh, the power substation. Yeah. Nothing too interesting, unfortunately, in the rest of the town. Although this is looking like... We haven't seen the nameplate yet. And this is all uh, mostly residential. So I think it's, it's a lot bigger than what I can see so far. It's going to go out at least probably this far. We haven't seen a commercial district yet. So, pretty good town nearby. Dairy farm, unfortunately, right on top of the town. Would have been nice if that was a little farther out. Mansion. Mansion it could be weapons and armor. It's out in the middle of nowhere, though, which means I'm going to end up having to fight zombies because I'll have no way to dodge, duck, or have cover on my way to it. <clears throat> I could back up, hang out in the uh, radio station till nightfall and then uh, I'll make my way up to the mansion in the dark hmm hmm What to do, what to do. Well, of course, first we reload. And then we reload the... And we reload the mag. <laughs> I don't know. I, uh, yeah. Of course, we make a shoulder strap for it. Because we know exactly how that works. Every self-respecting churl learns how to uh, craft a shoulder strap and attach it. So, we got our M4. We got our spare round of ammo. <laughs> and some additional beyond that. I don't know. I, I, I'm pretty torn in the whole gun thing. I mean, just how far do I push the, uh, <laughs> the, the theme like that? Do I not use medicines? Do I not... I mean, there's just so much stuff that I, I would not use or not be able to use. So, we'll carry it with me for now. If I start to run into weight or... Uh, uh, volume problems, I'll have to think about it. Yeah, I mean, it's not like he knows what these vehicles are, what a radio tower is, or, or so on. So I don't know how far to push the, uh, the theme. I know for certain I can't go near that town in the daylight. That I'm 100% of. So... Almost a 5 p.m.? Yeah, I think it's... Well, I guess I could go scout out the mansion. See if there's any chance. I, I just need to be able to get to the mansion, get inside, and preferably up to the second floor. Looks like they're, they're saying the entrance is on the north side, but for these types, eh, I've had that, that indicator lie fairly often. Got no food or water down here other than what I've got with me, which is not much left. <laughs> I've got the water that's not been uh, boiled yet. Supposedly. Pine nuts? Nope, no pine nuts. Pine nuts gone. Pine nuts no longer. Yeah, nothing else in the area. I'm kind of constricted in where I can go. I don't want to go traveling through the forest. 
Don't need the dump. Don't care about the cabin. Another farm. Um, nothing too interesting here, short of just trying to work my way into the town. But I'd much, much rather go to the mansion for now. Good chance we can get a, a medieval weapons or armor that would uh, help things out quite a bit. Yeah, let's work our way north. I could stand out in the middle of the field just as easily as sitting over here. So we'll go uh, back this way. The big danger is just getting caught out in the open. Or I, I have no possibility to evade. evade. So a uh, random Migo shows up or a horde of zombies. I won't be able to outrun them. So I hate coming out into the open like this. Oh, what do we got? Minor sights. Well, maybe not a minor sight. Holy crap. Elbow pads? All sorts of stuff. Alright, let's look at it individually. Headlamp? Binoculars! Well, that changes things a bit. We might actually be going back to that tower now. Yeah, we'll take the silver necklace, the whistle, and sure. Well. Wear the silver necklace. Take the harmonica. Monocles! <laughs> and a comb. Mm -hmm. Not bad for just laying around out in the middle of nowhere. Do I run back to the tower now? Because that would fill in most of that city, probably. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. That might change my mind and where we're gonna go, what we're gonna do. And it's just a quick trip back. That was fortuitous. Okay, what do we got? A mall! Ah, buried in the middle of a city. Look at all those horde indicators. <laughs> Alright, enough with the blinky. Actually, you can blink. Let's just turn off the hordes. Hmm, what did that add? Nothing else to the north. I found a lab, but I don't really care. A uh, cave? Again, I don't care. So, the mansion's all by itself. South, we got another city... We have a what? Oh, Amigo Scout Tower, yeah. Another little town. Beehive. So, the town of Belmont. What you got, Belmont? Other than a mall. Uh, a couple of subway entrances. I like the garage on the outskirts. Subway not too far in with a gun store nearby. Can't use any of the bookstore stuff. Don't need any of the um, vehicle locations where they can spawn. Yeah, subway, mill surplus, and the garage, kind of on the outskirts here in the south, along with the gun store and the houses that are nearby that give me some cover. So I like the south end of town much better than the north end of town. All right, I don't think this changes my, my path much. We're still going to go to the mansion first. Wait, where does that road go to the north? Since when do roads travel like this and then just stop? What happened there? You don't usually see roads just stop. There's almost always something at the end of the road. Huh. 
wonder if they're hiding something. Must be secret. Thank <laughs> you. 